Taurus, welcome to your October read for this current year, 2019. How are you doing, y'all? Missed ya. I'm doing quite all right. I got a kitty in my lap. Here, actually, watch these cards for me. Rub your face on them. Thank you. Good girl. Okay. Your cards are blessed, Taurus. Congrats. <laughs> For anyone new to my channel, and for those returning, this is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Check your charts. If this resonates with you a good deal, if not, do not worry about it. It's just a card game after all. Uh, might not work if you don't believe in it, and it might despite your disbelief. Just boop your nose and away you go. Don't concentrate too hard on it, right? Right. Alright, let us see. So, Taurus, what have we got for you? King of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Someone might be a selfish prick. Only think of what gets them to where they want to go. Unfortunately, the situation has a lack of clarity in it. Somebody might have a bad mindset, the wrong idea. Hell, there might even be a lie going around. You know, something like that. Wants and wishes is a princess of cops river. Someone is really stingy with their emotions. All because they got their feelings hurt. The obstacle and challenge you might be dealing with it. But, oh my god, if I could talk. The obstacle and challenge that might be coming against you that you could be dealing with. Prince of Wands, Leo Sag Aries, not taking any action towards this ace of swords this lack of clarity situation right can't know about the movie because i need to put my legs down they're getting tired and i'm old fears and rejections the three of swords reverse trying to fix your broken heart do you not want to go through heartbreak and having to fix yourself up after that I promise you, if you listen to a lot of Adele, it helps. How this situation starts, how it will end. Planting a flower in the desert, neglecting to understand that you are planting a flower in the desert, so your chances are highly unlikely. Um, looking at the situation and actually realizing how impractical things might actually have been. Beginning theme, Wheel of Fortune, the wheels are turning. And we are going on a trip. Please keep your hands and limbs inside of the bus, please. Lest you do not want to be um, in a lawsuit dealing with severed limbs. Just kidding. There probably won't be any severed limbs. I mean, unless you're like a serial killer or dealing with a serial killer. If that were the case, I would suggest not doing that or calling the cops before continuing on with what might get you murdered. Because that would be terrifying, honestly. I don't know where that came from, but I'm just saying. Terrifying situation. Now this King of Cups up here. He's really selfish, not even, like, paying attention to anybody else's shit, right? And there might be a lack of action on his part when it comes to the lack of clarity. But he might be pulling off the whole I don't care kind of thing. Um, and, and the only reason he's not taking any passionate actions because he doesn't want to deal with the whole heartbreak situation. This lack of clarity comes with somebody acting very indignant about a waste of fucking time, essentially, right? This king... Of uh, uh, cups, he was having people act like servants feeding him food. He already had everything he needed, but he got greedy. He, he, um, gre if I could talk today, he he got greedy. He wanted more. He was like, "Sir, I want some more." For some reason, um, yeah, he he was kind of drinking out of his own cup. It was supposed to be wine in that cup he was delivering, but instead, he drank all that shit, got drunk on the horse, went to a river, um, just started, like, fucking filling it up with water, and be like, oh, this is the same thing, you know, and just rode off somewhere. <laughs> Ugh. Taurus, is this you, or this is someone you know, but this person just gets drunk off their own shit. 
Like, they do a whole 360 and go back on their bullshit on a regular, I feel like. Ace of Swords, reverse. There's a lack of clarity in this situation. Um, someone's trying to make excuses for why this stuff should keep going. They're sending the bird out some messages like, hey, hold up, right? Even though they've been advised to disregard this shit. Like, people got, came up and be like, will you stop sending the birds over? Like, someone's looking for information and other people are coming up letting them know some shit instead. Like, not even the person they're sending the bird to. Other foe. Like, people who are neighbors just being like, look, your birds come by and we take the notes all the time and we just decided to follow the address on one of them. And it's like, we just came to tell you, um, it's time to stop, I feel like. It's like other people are going to be coming up with the information, so uh, you or the person you're dealing with won't have to make a move. Like they were on the verge of going on a fucking adventure and someone just told them they don't have to do it because they already did the light work. Ain't that a bitch? Like... <laughs> Excuse me. Your wants and wishes. There's a princess, the cup's here. Once again, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You could definitely be dealing with the water sign, Taurus. Um, they're all mad. They're upset. They're not being very um, upfront or even kind with their feelings if we're looking in at it the worst way because, you know, all three of these dudes are just reverse and angry and, like, kind of doing their own things and stuff. Uh, it might be dealing with the situation where, like, somebody was not tempted to tap that and have everyone, like, make fun of them. I feel like with the Devil card, could have been with a Capricorn, right? Oh, so, so like, okay, Taurus, I don't know if this is you, and I don't know if this is the person you're dealing with, but this querent here um, is an interesting person because they're want and wish, right? Um, they're all upset because someone didn't fall for their temptations and make it look like they were a hero and save somebody, right? Someone did not fall for that trap. The mission was aborted. It was all messed up. <coughs> this is very interesting, Taurus. Who are you dealing with, I wonder? Prince of Wands, reverse. Leo Sag Aries. Someone isn't taking any passion to action towards this shit. That's the obstacle and challenge. Because there ain't any love. The bird flew away. It was not a sit. It was like, um, you know in that movie Mars Attacks when they released the bird and the aliens just go, ah, ah, and just start killing everybody. It's kind of like that. Like somebody shot the bird. Um, that would have led to a new beginning somewhere else. It's like that love is dead. It's just somebody wants to take action. Like, this person is not in love. This is not a love situation in the slightest. This is just the action. Like, what's the point of doing all of this shit if you don't have any, like, real love? Like, they don't have the passion, they don't have the emotion, but they have, like, the action to take in... Like, they don't really like, want a lizard, but they want one just to tell their friends so they sound cool. Well, I need to put the rest of my groceries away. But I'm probably not going to, so I'm just letting you know. But yeah, like, that's what this person's doing. It's like, the obstacle and challenge is, it's, they're not, they don't give a shit. Like, in the slightest. All right, uh, three of the swords reverse in the fears and rejections. This queer, you're queering, right? They don't want to deal with the whole broken heart, having to heal that shit, right? Knowing that they aren't successful. In fact, they'd rather just end up shooting the person they were trying to save to begin with. Just to stop things. Like, it totally will self-sabotage if they got to... I don't like that. It's like they got, like somebody's got an enemy in their house. Yeah, you gotta move. Man. There we go. That's good. You know, it's like they're they're they're. they're it's almost like a desperate kind of thing. Like they don't want to feel like a loser to anybody. 
Like, you know, they tried to put their wreath on somebody's head and the bitch jerked her head away. Like, ew, no, don't touch me. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. <laughs> Oh my god, that's terrible. I apologize, but I just came out really messed up. Um, so it's just like they'd rather go on and, and assassinate people. They want to assassinate this and they want to assassinate this. How the shit starts and how it'll end. Seven of Pentacles Reverse. There's no running home to daddy. Because everyone packed their shit up and left. Or at least they should have. Hmm. That's kind of crazy. They can't run home to daddy for money? The fuck does that even mean? It's like the bazaar is already closed up. They made all they could, and now those kids sneaking in trying to take more than what he's supposed to. Like, don't go running to your dad. And, and, like, it's like this person wants to run to their parents and they can't because they sowed their seeds all wrong. So then it's like they wait until their parents aren't looking and then they go and dig in their, like, savings or something. Like, it's something fucked up like that. Like, you're sneaking into your parents' shit and taking something. It's just like, I'm down to my last 20, Mom. Can I borrow some money from you? No. I don't have any money. Then you go in, your pur in her purse and find a 50 and take it. Turns out that's what she was supposed to use to pay her medicine for. It's one of those fucked up situations that's gonna bite somebody in the ass. All because, like, they wanted to go after some other shit because they didn't want to feel like a fucking sore loser. Be careful with this person, Taurus, if this is not you. Crosswatcher, if this is a Taurus, Jesus Christ. This Wheel of Fortune, when it's the ending theme, someone saw this shit coming. Someone knew exactly that this is how things would turn out. Like, this bitch does not look surprised. In fact, she's got the keys to the fucking kingdom. She's just like, here you go. Here's your ticket. Have a nice ride. Like, she has been clued in the entire time. It's like, oh my god, this is such practical sense. How did somebody miss this? Ugh. This individual is like, they really, I don't know. It's like they set themselves up for failure and then act surprised when they alienate themselves or do something really fucked up on the side. Like, doesn't expect people to get upset with them. It's like they're too hard-headed and too desperate to understand that they can't always have their way. You know? But they're too selfish to get it, so they just, like, be back on their bullshit all the time. Let's see. They want to argue. They want to throw a fit. Actually. But I don't know what a, they don't know what a, they don't know what to throw a fit about. The fact that somebody came up and told them to stop sending messenger birds, or the fact that mom and dad said no and they went and snuck some shit in the first anyway. Like, what are they gonna argue about today? Like, what, what, what are we doing today? We're in. What are you doing? Oh, possibly walking away from shit. Hmm. Let me throw another one on that one. Ah. Uh, so this person wants to argue. But they don't know really what to do. And they eventually have to face the fact that they do have to walk away and find a method of healing their own broken heart. Taurus, I think this person wants to come up to you if that's the regard and, and, and make it to where like it's your fault that they have to deal with their own shit. It's like they're heartbroken, but it's your fault. And it's like... It's not really, but whatever. It's, I mean, like, you know, like, they're all mad because you didn't fall for the temptation and let them be a hero. And now they want to ride in like a hero, but they want to act like you're a dragon. And if this ain't you, this is, I mean, if this is you, man, like, hmm. 
This, like, this is not the best way of, like, dealing with your sadness, you know? But, that is the reading, y'all. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please like, share, subscribe. No pressure, but I'd greatly appreciate it. If you want a personal, all my info's down below. Newcomers, first one's in the house. Kitten, welcome back to my lap, even though I told you to get out. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.